56 here, metal detecting in Alaska. Back out on another metal detecting hunt on this minus 20 below day. So let's go to our next spot and see what we can find. Today I'll be using my winterized Bounty Hunter Time Ranger Pro. And I tell you, this thing finds everything. Kramer's Field. Let's go and hit our next spot. This is a fairly small playground. But I found a lot of good things here. I think I was at this playground when it was uh, like 50 something below with the wind chill. So good memories here. Well, I just ground balanced my Time Ranger and uh, I had to turn the sensitivity way down because there's a lot of elect electrical interference here. But you turn it down about halfway and it works fine. All right, let's see what we can find. Sure looks like it's gonna snow. Look at that dark sky. All right, first target. Looks to me like it may be some big money. Sweet. That's an awesome first target. Big money. All right, let's keep looking. All right, next target. I had to dig this big hole to find this bobby pin. I tell you, if these things were worth anything, I'd be rich. All right, let's keep looking. Well, no shortage of targets here. Discombobulated paper clip. Well, this is always nice. I found my long lost friend, Mr. Pool Tab. I knew we'd meet again. All right, let's keep looking. Maybe we'll find his brother. Well, next target, Mr. Lincoln, Penny. I don't mind being out here in the cold when there's so many targets to be found. All right, let's keep looking. Well, you know the best way to find good stuff is to dig everything. I had to dig this big old hole to find some aluminum foil. Rats. Well, I have some good targets underneath this piece of equipment. I always find a lot of good jewelry underneath these, so let's see what it is. Ooh, I see some shiny. Looks like it's some big money. No wonder I was getting such a good reading. Sweet. All right, let's scan and see if anything else is there. Well, I had another target right beside that quarter. And uh, this is a nickel. So cool. That's a good sign. Oops. That's a good sign. Well, somebody must have dropped a lot of coins because I found a quarter, a nickel. Here's a penny. Must have been a coin spill. There's still more targets. So let's see what else we find. Yeah, sure enough. Found another nickel. Awesome. All right, so I found all those coins right there. Looks like I found in more big money. Sweet. Definite coin spill. Now it's still digging targets up in that area. And I found this. <laughs> Alright, I think there's another quarter here too. Yep, one last quarter. 
has a pretty good coin spill. All right, let's look. I'm gonna go over to this spot, see what I can find over there. Yeah, more, more big bobby pins. That's a big one. Oh, look at that. Ah, oh, I found a ring underneath this. Sweet. Oh, look, it's got a little cross on it. It's shiny gold on the outside, but oh, look, it's rusted on that side. Rats. Ah, oh, but still sweet. A ring. All right, guys, I'm looking at you through the second ring of today. Wow. Sweet. Like I said, finding a ring makes it worth coming out in this cold. I wish it would have been gold. All right, awesome. Sweet, let's keep looking. The old jet flying over. Yeah, no shortage of these either. Go here, clasp. Well, while I metal detect, I like to play this little game called What the Heck Is It? So based on the numbers I'm getting, I always like to guess what it is. This is a solid 58. I'm saying a nickel. out can I see it look at there it's a nickel machine's dead on man sweet ah. starts burning your hand if you hold it too long because it's so cold Bobby pants. Well, found another piece of a zipper at the bottom of this slide. I've been finding lots of those today. Well, instead of it getting brighter, this guy just keeps going. Well, hey guys, welcome to my roundup. This is everything I found from my second hunt today on that minus 20 below day I had this weekend. I found some aluminum foil, a bunch of bobby pins. I'll tell you, if these things were worth something, I'd be rich. A little hair clasp some wire where a nut was cut off washers zipper pulls buttons check this out i found this giant container and i thought there was probably something in it somebody probably buried something at the uh, playground but it says it's from putty world and it says the combination of living objects and electricity can create an unseen world of shadows and violet light this is an aura which can be captured on film. Connect to your indivisible or invisible energy with Aurora Thinking Putty. White by day, but it glows a mystical purple at night to help you tap into your creative potential. So I guess it's putty that gl uh, glows purple at night. It says Crazy Aaron's Glow Thinking Putty. It feels like it's full. I'll have to try to open it and see what's inside it. So that was kind of exciting for a little moment. I found this, uh, of course, while I was hunting, my GoPro battery finally froze up and died. So you missed me finding this and probably a couple other things, these little doodads. But look at all the coins I found. I found eight pennies today. I found six nickels. How often do you ever find six nickels? three dimes and I found seven quarters and then probably the best thing today was this little ring that I found 
On one side it's shiny gold, but as you spin it, you can see it's all worn off and rusty. Still, I like finding anything with a cross on it. It's pretty cool. Not bad for a second little hunt at 20 below here in Fairbanks, Alaska. Alright guys, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see y'all next time. Going into surgery here in a few days, so I'll let you know when I'm out. All right, so I tried to open up this putty. I got the lid loose. Let's see what's inside. Looks like it had water in there that was frozen. Ugh. I'm just going to throw it away. Crazy guys, low thinking putty.